First of all, I'd like to ask all of you a question. Have you ever been afraid? Yes. Yes. Not just regular afraid. So afraid you won't even leave your room. So afraid of what's on the outside that you're trapped inside your own room. You're stuck on your bed and you can't move. Yes. Well, I can teach you how to turn that into a lifestyle. Excellent. How to be a shut-in. <laughs> I myself am a shut-in, so this is something I feel very trusted. Excellent. So, there are three types of shut-ins. A ni, a weeaboo slash a taku, and a person that's afraid of other people. I'm not going to touch on that last one, because that's not a choice. The first two are a choice. Um, moving on. What is a neat? A neat is a person not in education, uh, employment, or training. Basically, none of us, none of us, any, if you're in this room, you are not a neat, and I hope you never become neat, because that is the saddest thing ever. It's even sadder than being a weeaboo. <laughs> Next slide. This is what a weeaboo is. A weeaboo slash otaku. Otaku is the term for fanatic in Japanese, and that applies to, I'm pretty sure it applies exclusively to Asian people. But a weeaboo is basically a white, black, or Mexican person, Latin person that wants to be a weeaboo, or a la uh, an otaku. Um, up here we have a bunch of pictures of anime and Spongebob. Move on. <coughs> For step one, you need to learn how to cook. Now it doesn't have to be good food like what you see up there at the top or even that sushi, because that costs money. What you're going to want to do is eat yaki, yaki sola and top ramen. So, it's an extremely unhealthy lifestyle, but you can find this at um, the Chick-fil-A sometimes. <laughs> uh, today I have first I have five packs of it. <laughs> Step two, what you're gonna actually spend your money on. So here you can see not my personal one, mine's a little bigger than that. Uh, <laughs> and you're also gonna buy DVDs that you don't need because you can pirate anime on. I swear I spent over a hundred dollars on DVDs and novels and figures in the past week alone. Live with your parents. There's no shame of it in it. They can cook for you. You don't need to learn how to cook. You just need cups of ramen and your parents to cook it for you. Um, Sad life. 